G'day guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel now today. The AFL season starts in a couple of days time, so we are going to do a little bit of a prediction for the season. I did it this time last year and got a lot of them correct. Take a look. <laughs> Headline we will see, Damien Hardwick's time at Richmond is over. So today I have Austin, Liam and Connor, and we're gonna predict a couple of things to do with the AFL, and then we'll come back at the end of the year and we'll see how we went. I need the Brownlow medal winner oh, from all of yous. I'll start it off. I'll go with, um, on the improve, Joshua Kelly. I think Josh he'll Kelly. take it from the GWS Jacks. The Danger Goat. Danger Field. I'm going to say Rory Sloan. Big year. He'll sign on with the Crows and, uh, nah, he'll chase a big money. You know, I can, you know I can give her all still some votes on him? Or nah. I'm going to go with something a little bit, you know, out there. Jack Zebel. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. He's a hard nut. Oh, like, he's he's a, look, he would have got better all the other years in the boat count if he didn't get rubbed out every week. I mean, <laughs> just because he takes a few blokes' heads off, he's a big boy. Isn't it's it? just a shame you won't see how wrong you are at the end of the season because you're likely to have overdosed on Crystal Mouth. <laughs> <laughs> North Melbourne is and the worst AFL list I've ever seen in my time watching AFL this year. And a tip, our Coleman medalist for 2018. Danigo. Easy. No, Danigo. Easy. Now, uh, Buddy Franklin, right, in his third year, kicked 100 goals in a season. Was it his third year as an AFL? In his third year. Don't fact check me because I'm not. <laughs> <right. laughs> I have a feeling it was the third year. Now, if we're talking about players who are in their third year now ready to take the competition by storm, you're talking Charlie Kerno. Hey! Oh, Shazza! And Charlie Kerno will, will win the Commons. And the common medal, I believe, will be taken out by David Neitz. I'm going to go with Charlie Dixon. Very tall, very Black big, Hill. and um, yeah, he's going to win the Coleman. He's all wrong because the best looking man in the AFL, Ben Boner Brown. Oh, you know, that's not too bad. No, it's a genuine uh, yeah, crack. That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's a little more legit. That's going to be the only one you're going to be able to yeah. say. That's <laughs> it. That's a chance, come on. Alright, the next one we're going to predict is the wooden spoon for the 2018 season. North. <laughs> I'm going to say North. Now, I want to say North. This could be the... Peaks! I want to <laughs> say North, but I've actually got... This isn't even left field, like I'll go something different. I genuinely think this team will finish bottom of the ladder and it's Collingwood Magpies. Oh, not bad. Average least, poor coach, no way. Um, I don't know, I'm winding up between either Brisbane, Melbourne or Carlton. Oh, oh, three of those three teams, I, I don't we're, know. We're going to pick out top four. Oh, Jesus. The Adelaide first, Giants, Sydney, Tigers. Geelong, aren't Oh, the yeah. The, oh, I forgot about Geelong. He sucked Geelong off. And he, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Out of the town of Geelong, and now he just loves them. He loves them, them. them because I hate him. You disrespect them. I'll go Adelaide number one, Bryce Gibbs takes him to a premiership. I'll go Geelong number two. Danger, Ablett, Selwood in the guts, you finish in top two with that. Richmond number three, I don't think they'll fucking drop down. I'll rate it. I'll actually rate it. And uh, number four would be Port Adelaide, if they're my jumpers. GWS, Adelaide second, Richmond third, Geelong fourth. Fourth, I'm gonna go Brio. Oh, shut oh, up, you silly. No, 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 seriously, I reckon three are good. Like, five will be the man. Yeah, he's gonna be and real good. Shane, who's gonna kick a goal? Bradley Hill. Third, GWS. Given. Second, the Bulldogs. Oh, they feel top four. All right, no, second, Bulldogs. And top, like, I know you're gonna say it's gross and biased, but. Like, our, t our depth is actually pretty good. Oh. The ruse. Stop it. Get some help. North suck, like, genuinely. <laughs> A headline that you'll see this year. The footy show's back from the dead. Oh. <laughs> More than a day! <laughs> Beck Madden's my woman crush Wednesday. I love her. I love Beck. <laughs> Sam Newman took the Banyol Football Club from oh. yeah. <laughs> zero wins. <laughs> Put that clip in. From <laughs> zero wins in two years to Premier. <laughs> from the Banyol Bears. Make him welcome, Connor Rogers! Right. Welcome, boys. We normally start with the big guns, but we're going to start with you, Connor. It's great to have you back, mate. Yeah, thanks, Gary. It's good to be here. Thanks. Girls, Connor, uh, since you've been on the show, have you had any, a little bit of extra attention from the... From well, the I had uh, attention before I went on, but after, there's a little bit more as well. <laughs> and, Connor, that, um, that has... <laughs> That hairstyle you're running with is very Gary Lyon like. Have you uh, modelled it on the great man? Or? Well, it's the only place where I have hair, so I'm not like Gary. Oh. <laughs> he 
gave me personal support. Oh, no, I don't remember that. <laughs> he's a God amongst men, that. Well, you, you were getting stuck in a Gary Lyon fan here, weren't you? Yeah. 12 years old, free kid, tubby bring, little Asian. Bring, bring Banyol back. <laughs> the GWS Giants are the next 01, 02, 03 Brisbane Lions. It's a long head one, I'm not sure if it fits on the front <laughs> page or on the side. Yeah. Get it. <laughs> Paraphrase. Yeah. I mean, I feel like we've been saying that for about 10 years now and they've just done nothing. Two prelims in a row, they've been no. around for four years. No. Perth fans struggle to fill out new arena. They're not getting down to the games, why not? I just don't reckon they'll find it from Zuby. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's. Isn't it like right in the city? Isn't it like. He's branded right everyone from yeah. Perth as Simpleton. There you go. <laughs> I've, got a, I've got a bit of a co like so co headline. Okay. First headline is very early in the season, maybe around one or two, after North get pumped by 100 points. Scott sacked. <laughs> and come October 1st or whenever the grand final is, North defy all odds. <laughs> oh. 2018 promise. Who's a new coach that takes you to the flag? I'd love to say the dark, but the friend. <laughs> the dark. Um, Digby Morrell? Brady Rollins? Or sn snatching from oh, the yeah. wings? Surprise All Australian. But he is yet to be an All Australian, and he's played about 12 years of football, but Bryce Gibbs will be All Australian oh, at the Adelaide. I Lakers. love Giver too! <laughs> Bryce Gibbs will be All Australian at the Adelaide. I'm going to go with Callum Mills. The city's fine. He's like Oregon. I like it. I like it. Jacob Weedering. Oh! No, Doherty. You're, he doesn't play exactly like Doherty, but. It's a great call. Great call. Roger Magic Door. Oh. Newfound love as a Batman. Well, that would be. A Wouldn't it be romantic, the first ever Mate. Sydney's born player? You've got it wrong. It's, there will be a fullback all Australian that once upon a time was a key forward, and his name is Liam Jones. Liam Bones Jones, the best defender ever made. I'd back him in a one on one with Lockett Abelate. And that's his. What am I going to be, though? Oh, I like Liam Jones. Rising star. Oh, they reckon that that Witherden kid. Oh, oh, is, oh, is, yeah. is, he, is he still belly? Yeah. Well, I don't know how he can look past a bloke who's played, I think it's five games of footy, and one of them is a premiership where he kicked three or four goals, and that's Jack Graham for Richmond. I'm going to go Jaden Stevenson from oh. Collingwood. Don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> you can no. say it, but I, I just don't like it. <laughs> I don't <laughs> like it. <laughs> I'm going to say, shout out Cam Rayner, he's a star, but. Lab, what's his name? I have a feeling you're leaning towards Lucas Davis Uniac. The UDL. Last but not least, who is going to win the flag in the 2018 season? Giants. My Premier's um, Adelaide, once again. Bryce Gibbs comes in, <laughs> takes, launches them into Premier's. He's also going to win the Norm Smith with 38 touches. 13 goals. My premier is going to be the Tigers. Back to back oh, ticky time. Silly. I reckon. Here we go. Yeah, Tigers back to back. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> guys, thank you so much for watching. Comment down your AFL season predictions down below. I'll be commenting on a few of those. I appreciate all the support. I appreciate all of you guys watching. I want to thank Liam, Austin, and Connor for coming on the video. Liam. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Sign. Wow. Not there,